Hey guys, this is Fernando from Fixipedia. Um, coming here with another video, uh, how to repair. <coughs> uh, this is a. <coughs> Sorry. An HP model, and it's a G6 2017 SP. The problem is it turns on and there's no picture. So let's just try it on. Get this okay it's in I've already got it a little, a little disassembled so you can see the light goes on and no picture fans on it's pretty dirty so um, now you got basically four options on this. You can either do a reflow on the graphics chip, and that'll probably work around two weeks, maybe three months if you're lucky. You can also do uh, order a new graphics chip, but that'll probably be as expensive as a new board. That's your third option get a new board then you've got a fourth option well and that's gonna be first things first you gotta remove the heatsink Heatsink removed, as you can see, it's pretty much dirty. So this this one was probably used a lot in, on top of um, uh, surfaces that were not clean. And now this is your graphics chip. And the the fix that I'm going to show you, it's 100% um, doable. There's no problem. You don't have to reflow. You don't have to reball. You don't have to do anything. You just need a soldering station and you're going to do two things you're going to take off this coil over here and you're going to change uh, this resistor which is R550 and you're going to put it on the space that says R549 okay so that's like a jumper setting I'll link in a few pictures for you to see as well so let's get started
Okay guys, I know this type of repair, it ain't pretty but it does the job, so this thermal paste we're going to have to take out, it's uh, really dry. And after that we're going to clean the um, heatsink and everything. The only thing to do now is to change the little resistor, the one that I spoke about is down over here by this chipset and it's on the R550, you're going to change it to the R549, okay? So, a little bit of patience, I don't know if I can see and film as well, but we're going to try. Okay, let's see. It's not easy. Try and give you a better picture of what what it looks like. So it was over here on this space of here. It was vertical. Now it's on horizontal. Okay. So let me just let me give it a little reflow here. Okay, so now all you have got to do is use some cotton swabs and some isopropylic alcohol. Just clean it up. Just clean those flex residues. Okay, so let's go and test it. Okay, so we're just going to test it just to see if it's working. Put in the power adapter first, power jack, just fit it in here, see that everything's okay. Just the power button just to turn it on. Okay, insert power supply and here goes nothing turns on look like oh yeah okay everything's working all I gotta do now is clean it up put on some new thermal pastes um, clean out the board put in all the components and just see if it's working okay thanks listen if you like the video uh, please thumbs up and subscribe um, it's the only way that the channel can keep growing okay thanks bye bye